Welcome back to another cooking video. Today I'm going to show you how to make a cute little panda sushi bear using this kit I found on Amazon. It was only like three or four dollars and possibly the best investment I ever made. Now, if you want to get the same one as I've got here, then I'll leave a link in the description below where you can find it or in the top left corner of your screen. Let's get going. Let's make it happen. Okay, start by taking the panda cutting tool, which is this part with the little teeth on one side to cut the nori. And you just want to take your silicon mat as well, which comes with a kit. And just line up the nori sheet with the silicon mat to use the most of it. And just place your cutting tool on top and then press down and move around pressing down until you don't hear any more cracking noises. The cracking noises is when you're cutting the nori. And then just lift it up and voila. Half of the components will just fall out out of their own if you've done this right. And the rest of them you'll just have to softly remove out of the nori, making sure not to tear them. See this one feels a little bit tough, but just removing it softly. Okay, so be very careful not to tear any of the components, especially the center one, the long one here that I'm taking out right now. It's very, very fragile and it normally tears if you don't take care. There we go, it came out perfectly. Right, I'm just gonna take the little panda eye patches out Great. Okay, and now I've removed all the components and I've got them all here ready for assembly in a bit. Okay, now I'm gonna make the sushi rice panda mold. For that, you take the other three parts of the kit and you just take the front face and you place it in first. Then you wanna take some cooked and seasoned sushi rice and just pack it in nice and tightly. If you don't know how to make sushi rice, check out my recipe in the description below or in the top left corner of the screen. Once it's packed in nice and tightly, you take the back end, which has a little handle, and you just press it in and compress the two components together, just like so. Then once it's compressed, you just remove it out and separate them out, and the bear should come out just like this. Okay. Then you just take your nori cutouts and place the panda face down and just take the longest part and center it up with the middle and then curve it round all the way to the front. Now it's worth noting my hands are a little bit wet so the sushi rice doesn't stick to it and so that I can pick up the nori just like so. And then this is just a little panda eye patch. You just place it where you think the eyes will be and take the other one and place it directly opposite. And then take the nose patch and place it right on the peak, right there. Okay, great. Now I'm just gonna take the feet components and place one on this side. And take the other foot component and place it just on the opposite side, just like I did the other one. Okay, now I'm just gonna put it upright. All right, it looks like a nice little cute bear at this point. Just gonna take the panda ears and line it up and then fold it over both sides, just like so. And then I'm gonna do the same with the other ear component, line it up and then fold it over both sides and press it on until it stays on. Then place it on its front again and just put the tail on. And voila, you have a nice little panda sushi bear which you can play with or make a little army of. Enjoy. Hey, right, so that's the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it and please don't forget to hit the like button if you did and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching. See you guys next week. Goodbye.